I came up with Supernova when one day I was driving with my husband and the thought just popped in my head of what would happen if the, a star went supernova too close to Earth and blasted us all with radiation. Was becoming an author a top goal? Uh, not necessarily. I decided to become an author when I was an adult. Do I plan on turning Supernova into a series? Um, only if I have a lot of popularity and people really like it. Um, right now I'm in the middle of writing a different book. Supernova is about a woman waking up on her lawn where she doesn't know what happened to her and that the world got blasted with, a, with radiation from a star going supernova and then people started getting superpowers but they were getting sick as they used it. Um, does it relate to real life? Um, not particularly, but you know, just how a small town might, might react to a major crisis. It took me three years, a year of writing, and then two years of trying to find an agent and getting published. My inspiration for my main character is that I never got to have a daughter, and I thought that it would be kind of fun to write up a daughter. In five years, I hope that I will be in major bookstores and have a couple of books published. My advice for high school students that live in a small town would be to never give up on your dreams and to keep trying hard for things that you want. Even if you're from a small school, you can accomplish big things. My opinion of growing up in a small town like Almond is that it's a nice place to grow up and that it's small and you get to have better connections with your friends because there's less people to know, so then you get to know them a whole lot better.